G'day everyone. Um, this is my entry into Lenny Von Ness 2 Downton Abbey Challenge. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm going to get straight into it. Hi Lynn and congratulations girly. Um, I think you said this is your first challenge. So yeah, it's a good challenge. I like it. It's um, I love the theme. So yeah, alright. So there, uh, if I remember, I'll put the link below. If I don't remember, please let me know <laughs> and I'll do it. Okay. Okay, I have t chosen to do a mini album for you, Lynn. So I'm going to just bring whoop, this down just a little bit. Whoa, that's a bit too much. Sorry, everyone. It's probably making you feel a bit... Ooh. Anyway, the front cover has got um, Timeless... It's called Timeless Papers by Case of Craft. They're a bit old now, but it doesn't matter. It still fits the theme, I reckon. Um, on the front, I have this gorgeous crocheted flower from Hazel. And I've also got some little diamante things here from Irene. And, all, of course, Irene's trim. I'm in dire straits now because... This is all I have left, so I'm going to be going and visiting you, Irene. <laughs> Her Zibbit store. And at the back here, thank you, Hazel. This metal embellishment here is from Hazel. And I've embossed the spine. Yeah. Um, I'll put the link when I find it, the original um, video of how to do the pages. I did a mini album for Irene Seriously Scrapping a while back. I think it was a birthday challenge and I used the same um, principle on this mini album. Okay, I'm just going to try and go out a little bit. That's in. Okay. So in the front, I have... I'm not going to open this. This is for Lynn to open. It's just pictures, but going to leave some things as a surprise um, and of course the Downton Abbey crew and this is just a, a journaling or photo whatever you want to do okay and each each page I'll tell you the layout of the page it's a top loading pocket one in the front and one in one in the back okay so you'll that's out of a 12 one 12 by 12 page so it's the way you fold it Okay, so I'll just put that back there for a sec. So it has a top tag. So I'm not going to pull all the tags out. Okay, because this is what they all look like. I've left left it blank so you, Lynn, can um, you know make it your own. And then you have a tag from the front here. Okay. And then the other side is exactly the same. All right, so that's how you go about this mini now. The layout for this mini. All right. It's just a little belly band across that I've done on all pages. Now this one here, and and Lynn, forgive me, but um, I only got to watch. I didn't even get to watch all of the first season, and then my life became um, busy, so I don't watch a lot of TV. So anyway, and I can't remember the names of everyone. I know that this is the daughter and the one that passed away and it's just been beautifully done. They've taken the photo and someone has um, done it like a painting and I just loved it. I just thought, you know, the how she's sort of in deep thought and yeah, I just loved it. And that's just a tag. And this green trim here goes well with it. Uh, I think Manja Nolene, I think you gave me that there, that little crochet doily there. So it's all just crocheted trims and bits and pieces and little doilies throughout and lace. And this is the mum. I just think that is just so elegant. She's just beautiful. And of course having tea in the garden. And these are the three girls. And again, just a photo mat for you to do whatever you like with. I think that's just lovely, the three girls. Uh, 
and this <laughs> this is my funny page <laughs> I love this and I love these two I think these two characters just play the parts so so well I mean she's the cranky old thing but she's also adorable and this one here she's so um, I think she's she loves things her own way which is the right way but um, these two are just a laugh and it says I take that as a compliment and she said I must have said it wrong I can just hear them now <laughs> they're funny and this one of course we all love the cook hey and she says Daisy I said you could go for a drink of water not a trip up the Nile and I can hear her saying that too it's a great show and they're just again photo mats journaling whatever and on this side is the famous oh golly I can't remember a name I don't remember their names I'm hopeless but this is just beautiful the wedding photos um, of her that I have seen they are all stunning and this one just was just that moment thinking and of course this one's really really old looking I love it and it's of her and him I never really, really liked him. I mean, I was all good for these two getting together, but I never really quite took to him. But anyway, each to their own. And I love how, I love this trim, the lace and the the black and the white. I have, love that. Okay. And I put the lace a little too high, but with a little bit of fiddling, you can get it to not fold under and... And the last page, I love to. And these are Bates. I remember Bates because he. I love him in um, another show. Another. I think it's Like Rise to Crawley or something like that. I can't remember. And of course, the maid. Can't remember name. And here they are. I know. And there they are. I just love these shots. I thought they were really good. So I've inked them up. And this. <laughs> I love this. It says, Miss O'Brien in the washroom with a bar of soap. We all know what she got up to. I don't know whatever happened to her. So if someone knows, can you leave a comment down the bottom and let me know? Because like I said, I didn't get to watch them. But I know she was a real cow of a thing. And um, at times. But she, yeah anyway so I think I don't think she's in the show anymore so and that's it my lovelies that's that's the album so Lynn I hope you like it um, hope to get that in the mail next week and yeah so enjoy the rest of your challenge and talk to you all later bless you bye